Hey guys, Dean Mike here. Hello and welcome back to another episode of The Legend of Zelda The Wind Waker HD. Last time, we went to the Fire and Ice Isles. Got some nice goodies. Let's see what we got. Let's see what we... Let's... Hold on. Great, okay. So... We were able to get the Fire and Ice Arrows. Obviously. One of those locations, I forget, yielded the iron boots to keep us grounded in the power bracelets. So, pretty nice. I think the power bracelets are like permanently attached to us now, which is great. Um, we got some sailing to do. Viewers, how about that? And if you like that, if you could like this video, comment, and subscribe, we're actually going to be heading southwest. So just, you know, a little reminder on how to get to the Southwest. I will admit, it has been, I think I checked, a month and a half since I've played this game. It's been a hot minute. Ooh, fish. Hello? Hello? All right, hold on. Do I have any of that stuff? Any of the bait? Are you going to take the rage bait, viewers? Are you getting baited? Let's do this. What do I do? In hoi pairs. Perfect. What's up, homeboy? Where are you? Oop, there we go. I actually panicked. Because I forgot how to do the cruising button. It's been a hot minute. Long time. Yeah, I usually record these for pulling the curtain back a little bit to give you a behind the scenes. I usually record these about a few days in advance, but it's been recent. Has not, sorry, it has not been recent that I've done this. So he's basically telling you about how to get to Fire Island, how to get to Ice Island. We've already done that because we're amazing. Thanks, bro, Namath. But we are headed southwest, south by southwest, to that little icon down there. Let's speed it up, shall we? And you're like, oh, is he going to speed up the footage? No. Because I haven't had a chance to really talk with you viewers. It's been a hot minute. We have some plot. To advance. Ooh, there's another fish too. Two fish in one episode? Wait, do I already have that? I don't know if this counts as this square or not. We're gonna find out right now. The game just immediately jumps into that cutscene. I don't think this guy should have any good advice. Oh. Yeah, this is talking about increasing our magic bar. Play with you a bit? What? Okay. Oh, we're not going to be able to do this. I'm horrible. I didn't even know this was a thing. Where are you? Nope. Oh. Okay, great. I forgot even how to draw the arrow. It's clearly telling you what the button is. Got him! Alright, not bad. I'm not feeling very confident at this. Oops, okay. We at least have 20 rupees. I think this is for free, I mean... Okay. I was really proud of those first, of the second and third shot, and then I just completely forgot how to do this. Oof. Yeah, I'm not, not good at this, and I was not expecting to put this in this episode, so. I did not even know this was a thing. 30 rupees, not bad. I'm not really hurting for cash right now, but it's okay. Oof. This is like me trying to, Aim the, the pester balls and Pokemon Snap. That was horrible. 
30%. I mean, thanks, I guess. Yeah, I didn't know... I didn't know that was a thing. So, I'm not... I'm not upset about it. Probably would have preferred... A little bit of advanced notice. But that's okay. Okay, so we're heading over to this island here on the left. Ooh. Man, I'm so distracted. The game is like... What did I call distraction simula- Oh, it was uh, Odyssey. Odyssey was horrible about that. I could not help myself to save my life. This game's not too far removed from that. And just wait till how much nonsense we're going to get into with, uh, with Pikmin. But there we go. That's a quick 80 rupees between the two things. I made promises to say that I was going to always go for these when I saw them, and I lied. I stopped doing it. But that's okay. Sometimes you gotta break some promises. You gotta crack a few eggs to make a promise omelet. Promelet? That's not a thing. Okay. So, this, my friends, as we're just cruising along, this is Headstone Isle. And you can't really do much here until you wind up with power bracelets. So this big old honking head right here. And these crabs. Getting head and crabs. Can't do anything with that until you... Boop! Move that around. Interesting. Oh! Viewers, does this look familiar? Huh. Maybe a new tune? I'm gonna mess this up immediately. Looks like down, down, nothing. Right, left, nothing. Wasn't that it? Hold on. Do I have to acknowledge this? Oh, sorry. Now I can do it. I think I was right, though. The game's like, um, stop jumping ahead in the assignment. And this song rules. This episode's basically going to be prep for the incoming dungeon, which I don't think we'll get to today, but we'll get close. Oh, cutscene. Oh, fish lady. Oh yeah. This is one of the Zora. Larudo. A Zora Sage. So as you all know, we do have the Master Sword, but we gotta power it up, and this is one of the steps to do so. And we're gonna need a little bit of help. Stole my soul! Hmm, I wonder who could help us. Do we know anybody that played a harp? It's a very goofy face on it, it's like, Damn, I'm a harp, look at me! I got strings on my face where my nose is! Ooh, there's gonna be a new sage, okay. So obviously we'll be coming back here shortly, but we need help from one of our friends. We need to get blown first from the winds of fortune. Okay. So, it's not really clear what you're supposed to do unless you remember who also plays the harp thing? But we know. It's our girl Medley. Back at Dragon Roost Island. So we're just gonna take a quick peek at the... Down, right, left, up? Okay. Oh, 
I'm so proud of myself. I didn't even have to look at the music. All right, so we're gonna be heading to Dragon Roost Island, which is here. Go we'll pop in and say hi to Medley. It's been a minute. It's been a little bit since we've seen her. So why don't we just pop in and say hello? Sometime today, game. Let's get it going. All right, hop out. No time for cruising. But you do get to enjoy, of course, the wonderful songs. Okay. Can I get up there from here and not have to do all this crap? Yes. Very cool. I love that for us. So we're going to be going to the very tip of the top. First, gotta head inside. And if you want to, you can play the mail sorting game. Not interested in that, because I do not care. Okay. Uh, can I go up higher than this? I think it's out here, maybe. Is this it? I don't know. I think this is where I'm trying to get to. You hear that? I'll be quiet for a second. You hear that? Little strummy strum strum. Nope. I forgot how buttons work. Here we go. Here we go. Game, just let me do it. I don't remember how to do anything. Is it not this button? What button is it? This? Oh, quit. What am I doing wrong? How do I engage with this? What is happening? How do I... Hold on. It has been so long since I played this. I don't remember how basic things function anymore. It's one of the downsides of recording a month and a half in between. And I only do one episode at a time, so that's definitely bad. But there she is. There's Medley. We figured it out. We're done being an idiot. Hey girl, what's going on? Safe and sound. Yeah, you now that he stopped being a little baby. Oh, it sounds like Kamali's got a little crush. How old is Medley that she's talking about Kamali like that? This is kind of weird. Hee <laughs> Anytime someone does that, I'm like, don't. A little MJ action. Alright, so now that we have this new tune... Oh! Of course. Um... Let's just go ahead and take a little peek at the... All right, baby girl, play us some tunes. Here we go. Yes. Time for cutscenes. Like where I put my car keys. Did I poop today? Oh, and she's dead. Sorry about that, Medley. This was actually the song of instantly murdering you. Now in this game, I don't know if this is presented elsewhere in Zelda lore, but there's supposed to be some sort of knowledge that through time and evolution, the Zora turned into Rito. So that's why this connection is being made. It also really upsets me that they didn't animate her hands to match the notation that she's playing. 
How hard would that have been? Also, look at her feet. Shouldn't she have, like, talons? Medley, why do you have human feet? You're a bird. And you're not real. Yeah. So, Medley is tripping balls right now. All kinds of hallucinations. Oh. She wakes up and she's like, oh, Link. She spoke so gently. Something that I must do. What do you think, viewers? Okay, so, surprise! She was just going to be a boring attendant, and now it turns out that she's actually a sage. What an upgrade. A promotion in hat. In hat. That's not a thing. Perhaps... Wake the power to repel the evil? I mean, I guess. I guess. Oh, hey, it's Kamali. He's just... Hanging out? What's up, homeboy? Okay. Awesome. I'm gonna cruise on over to Beetle here. I don't think there's anything I can get from him. We will be going and doing that in just a moment. But there is one thing I wanna check out before we do this. Okay, so nothing cool. Beetle, you're dead to me. There is some stuff that we can do with... Let me get off Beetle real quick. That's not bad. Medley is in the boat with us. I think that I might be getting required to go and do uh, what I need to do, but I want to check my map because is the, game being, is the game being like this? Can I use my map and my stuff now? Game, why are you doing this? This is one thing the game does from time to time. It glitches out. I don't care for that. But we need to be heading back to from whence we came. Check this song real quick. Oops. <laughs> I thought it was nothing. It was not. Okay, so we want to go back to where we were. We're going to go to Outset down here. I had an idea of what I wanted to check out, but that's okay. There's more stuff you can accomplish, too, on Windfall if you want to. But I wasn't feeling particularly interested in that. I would love Medley to just chime in on how dumb it is that I forget everything. But she's kind, she wouldn't say that. So we're going back to Headstone Island. I don't really know why they have you do this. This feels like padding to me, but it's okay. It does make me interested though. We did talk to that fish saying something to the effect of what the reefs can do. And this is another submarine. Have we done this one? I'm not getting distracted and delaying the game. Does the I wish the game would tell you if you've done these. Just because it doesn't. Oh, this is bombs. This looks familiar with all these rats killing themselves. Hopefully. 
kill yourselves. And the frame rate just absolutely pooping itself. All right, I think this is going to be... Oh. Well, I guess that menu is just off for now. Until I'm done with this recording, apparently. This this happens sometimes. I actually had that happen in, another, in a previous episode. I don't remember which one it was. But it was considerably annoying that I am unable to essentially use that menu and I forget how I fixed it. But it's not really a huge deal. Oops. Got one more here. Oh, two more. Three more. Did I do it? Oh, there's still one. Yeah, this is probably a waste of time, but you know, you don't know until you know. Okay. We did it. It would be cool if it would just be like, you have no business here. Like it did in some of the places of Odyssey. Yep. Well, you know what? We're gonna take your goodies. Yeah, that's really frustrating that I cannot... Oh, there it goes. Oh, okay. I don't know what I did. I just hit... I just mashed random buttons. That's good. But we do have... This is... If I'm looking at my map... This would be the, I think, the Bye Bye Reef? I think? I don't know if that's accurate. That, that's what my notes say, but I don't know how... I just want to go to it. Where is it? Didn't I just see it? Um... This is Headstone Isle, obviously. Yep. Oh, it's forcing us to do this. Never mind. No detours for you. Cool. The nest of an evil creature. <laughs> okay. A little end game mechanic. All right, so now we do learn about the mechanic of using medley to fly. And also the command melody. This is this dungeon's kind of weird, but you'll see. All right. But, unfortunately, this is something that we're going to be doing next time. So, thanks for watching, everybody. I've been D-Mike. This has been The Legend of Zelda The Wind Waker HD. And I'll see you next time for The Earth Temple. If you enjoyed this episode, if you could like this video, comment, and subscribe, and check out them YouTube Shorty Shorts. And I'll catch you next time for more. Bye.